Hello, everyone. This is Karina Connor 100, or KC 100 for short. Welcome back to my narrated Pokemon Battle videos. Yes, that's right. It's been a hot minute since my last upload. However, I did not mention anything about ending my time here on the channel. I still play Pokemon and other games from time to time, but the reality here is there's other commitments I need to do that are far more important than uploading content on YouTube. I mean, doing YouTube is a hobby of mine, and I, when I can't upload, so be it. Fortunately, though, I'm here now, and I have something for you today. With that said, let's get right into the battle preview. Okay, so what we have here is a showdown battle. Oh, you care, of course. Nothing too crazy. Uh, with the release of the second DLC, the Indigo Disc, we now have access to Pokemon from other games, as well as brand new Paradox Pokemon. Think I speak for everyone here who's watching this video right now when I say, yes, all of the starter Pokemon are finally back in Scarlet and Violet, and it feels so freaking good. Listen, we're using Superior today, as well as my favorite Paradox monster to date, and I know, other critters out there will probably disagree with me on this, but Raging Bolt, man. This is a fantastic looking Pokemon with a very intriguing design and a new priority move in Thunderclap. These two Pokemon are my main attackers in this fight. It's possible that Cinderace would like to have a word with me on that, but it's okay. We are good. Let's not forget about the Fable, Gondozo, and Astrodome. I think that covers the team preview. Let's start this thing. Okay, Pokemon trainers, here we go. I hope you enjoy the match. I actually switched over to my microphone. Hopefully I sound a little bit better. I need to do this in the future, all right? So I start out with Excadrome. Not a good matchup, especially when you're against a Cindy So I switch out and go into Cinderace for the better typing matchup, obviously. Here I really thought he was going to switch because Let's face it, the city Y actually runs train on my team, not gonna lie. So I went for that high jump kick and we missed it. So I go down without really doing anything, which kind of sucks. Without Cinderace, I really don't have a better move to hit him with outside of... I don't even know. Pyro Ball was going to do it, but we didn't get a chance to do it. So Clefable is out here setting up Stealth Rocks and going for Wishes. Plus protect. You can argue that there might be a better move set, like having flamethrower, for instance. I don't have flamethrower. I really don't have. I wish I did, but I don't have flamethrower on this set in particular. I gotta do that for next time. But for this scenario, wishing protect will work out here just fine. So I go for moonblast here. It's not going to make much of a difference. I mean, I put some chip damage to it. Which is better than nothing, I suppose. So even though we lose two Pokemon here, we're going to forge on and we're going to see how we do with Raging Bolt out here. Raging Bolt is one of the new Paradox Pokemon that I really like. Alright, we're going to use it pretty efficiently here. He goes for Defog as I go for Calm Mind. That kind of, well, it would be nice to have Stealth Rock damage on other Pokemon, but it's okay, Clefable, you did something in this fight, but not entirely now. He goes into Lycan Rock. I have an answer for this thing. We have Gondozo, look at that, that did less than 15%. That's pretty awesome. I go for Liquidation here, and it does some damage to the Disable Eye, but the main thing I'm trying to do here is put some damage onto it and then switch out and go into superior honestly i really should have switched out into superior earlier but that's okay i realize now is an opportunity to use superior like i said in the team preview if you watched it superior is also the main focus because we now have full access to starter pokemon guys and why not use superior it's been a while right so we go for that plus two boost it, well, I mean, it's not boosted yet, but we're going to get that plus two when we go for that Leaf Storm. We knock out the Sableye right there. I am walled by this thing, Corporate Knight. Yeah, but we have the Glare. Now, people were assuming that 
I guess my opponent was thinking I'm choice or something, but I'm not. Which kind of fools them pretty good there, right? I go back into Raging Bolt to dodge a Brave Bird or at least resist it coming in. And now we can go for a Thunderbolt, okay? But he goes to the carrot ground. I really should have seen that coming, but I didn't, unfortunately. That's okay, because we can go for Dragon Pulse. Although I could have just gone for another Calm Mind, as he could have just switched out maybe, or he could have gone for another Brave Bird, as he does right there. That's neither here nor there. He does have recoil damage, so that helps me out in taking him out, right? He goes back into Rock. I really thought he was going to go for the Stellar Rock, so I went for the Thunderclap, could pretty much out prioritize him, but he didn't go for it. That was kind of strange. I don't know how fast Raging Bolt is, but it is what it is, right? So now at this point in the match, Superior is my win condition. Is he ever? Holy crap, or I guess it's a female, right? Yeah, so she, excuse me, she will be my win condition now, and this is going to help me out here. I do like Samurai. One of my favorite Pokemon of all time. He got a Hysterion form and everything like that, but we have to take him out. So that leaves with just Gallade, and I actually misclick, and I was going to go back and change back to Leaf Storm, but it was too late. So we paralyzed the Gallade for no real reason. He did get paralyzed there to make up for it, but that's just a little extra salt in the wound from my opponent. So we end up winning this fight 3 to nothing or 6 to 3 when I went 2 and 0 to start off the fight with me losing Cinderace and Clefable. Anyways, that's it for the match. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's pretty self explanatory of a video here, especially when I haven't uploaded in some time. I just wanted to upload something. Now, I feel like I'm going to try this out, okay? I'm going to try uploading once or twice a month. Because, like I said, I got other commitments to work on, or focus on, rather. And I really need to do that. So, we'll see how it goes. I hope to continue uploading for you guys in the year 2024. Thank you again for coming to this video. Be sure to give me a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. With that said, I'll see you guys in the next battle video. See ya!